Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's Don't Touch My Afro, and we're about to get into another video. Turn it up loud. Okay. So, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Hello, my name is Taylor. And I go by my YouTube channel name, Don't Touch My Afro. And yeah, and if you're returning, hi sis, thank you for coming back. I know y'all tired of me coming on this camera. I know y'all probably like, if you come film one more video looking crazy without a face on, it's gonna be problems. I know, I know. But today, the thing is, I have a haul for you guys, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Which is why I don't have my makeup because I plan to film a makeup look after I show you guys some of the goodies that I purchased from Alta yesterday. Mm. Oh, we're gonna get right into the video. Don't mind me eating. I'm eating some turkey sausages because I'm hungry. I got my water, my turkey sausages. I'm ready to go. Is y'all ready to go? Let's go. This is my bag of goodies from Alta. So in this bag, I have a bunch of goodies that I went to Alta and I just kind of went a little crazy. Because I feel like with my makeup, I feel like I've been needing more makeup. A lot of the stuff that like I use is like really old and I need to kind of experiment and try new things because I'm kind of getting a little bored, you know? Like we all need to spice it up a little bit. So the first thing being, yes. So I have two of the Jaclyn Hill palettes. I know you're probably like, why do you have two? One for me. One for me. These are amazing. So let's get into this palette because it is gorgeous. It's gorgeous. It's popping. This is also the Bling Boss. The Bling Boss palette. And yeah, it just really stuck out to me when I seen it when I was in... Alta and I was like I need to get this and I want to say this ran me I actually have the receipt so that I could tell you guys prices on a momento okay <clears throat> so the Morphe palette ran me about $15 dollars, girl $15 dollars. so packaging cute and then oh, wow it's backwards let me do that again so it's still it's basically the same thing as the cover. It looks the exact same. I'm really trying to make it so that you guys can see this here, but it's so on. And then here's the palette. So the inside of it is super sleek as well. And as you know, these colors are so freaking beautiful. The colors are beautiful. Like I've seen this and I was like, this is gonna look so good on deep skin because y'all us dark skin women these colors are just amazing I mean that's really all I can say so I'm definitely gonna be doing a look with these colors today and I love that these colors is like it's definitely giving me fall fall I'm just so in love with this palette because it just looks so freaking beautiful it's so blitz and it's so glam Next up is my Real Techniques Beauty Blender. I I used to order beauty blenders like off of Amazon and eBay and stuff like that, but I just find that the Real Techniques sponge is like so beautiful. And like nobody's trying to pay $20 for the Real Beauty Blender at Sephora because who got time for that? Who got time? And I think you should really like renew these like every three months or something like that. I don't even know, but um, it's 
yeah, <laughs> it actually tells them on the back, replace every one to three months. So, yeah, I'm not about to pay $20 for a little sponge that needs to be replaced every one to three months. You tripping? This was on sale. This is normally, I think, like $10 at my Ulta, but this ran me $5. 23 actually it's originally 7.99 i was wrong but it did run me 5.23 because it was on sale and i had a low coupon so that's what i paid for this and this isn't the small like actual makeup beauty blender i actually got the body sponge one because i typically see raven elise use the huge one and i'm like ooh, like i really feel like i like this one this is about to be magic so Next up, I've actually never used this product, but I wanted to give it a try because I kind of need to spruce up my makeup and do like some, you know, out there looks different from what I'm used to doing. So I did want to get some colored um, eyeliner. And so I picked up this NYX Vivid Bright in the color Vivid Petal. Yep, in Vivid Petal. So this is it. I'm actually super excited to use this. Um, I did swatch it on my hand when I got home. And it's just super pretty. It looks like this. And I feel like I could do some pretty good looks with this. So I'm super excited. This ran me $6.54, which like I said, I did have a coupon. So I got 45 cents off, money is money. My next thing that I purchased was <clears throat> this contouring stick. Well, really, it's like a foundation. <clears throat> Excuse me. Well, it's the Maybelline Superstay Multi-Use Foundation Stick. I do think that this is a little bit too dark for me. I don't know if you can see the color in there. I think it's a little bit too dark for me, which is great because I want to use it as a contouring stick. It's really hard for me to find contouring sticks for my complexion and yeah, it's just super hard to find it. So this is darker than my skin color. So I was like, you know what? Hopefully this works. I really do hope it does. If not, I don't know if y'all know this, but if something does not work for you at Sephora, at Ulta, don't even matter if you used it, as long as you got like this much left, you can return it. You welcome. This ran me $11.99 so this is $12 and yeah for $12 like I'm gonna get all my coinage back if this is not worth it so we'll see my next thing that I purchased was the um Urban Decay All Nighter Spray I love this right now I am using the NYX matte setting spray which is fine I like the NYX but this is the one thing that I found that works for me so freaking good like I'm super oily I like to be matte just because like my natural oils do come in on my face throughout the day like I become a grease ball so and yeah I was using milk and magnesia and I don't know I wouldn't recommend it I feel like my face looks so much better now that I don't use milk and magnesia but I was using it and that is not like great for your face so you want to make so like setting sprays and primers are things that I will splurge a little bit when it comes to makeup like obviously from time to time I splurge on what I buy but I'm perfectly fine with drugstore and like cheap makeup which is not cheap to me but but certain things like my setting spray and my primer I really do like to splurge on those because I am so freaking oily I'm a grease ball it's ridiculous it's ridiculous and this ran me this is actually the full size I normally only get the travel size which is like 15 but this time I went ahead and got this because sis let me put you on so this um urban decay all nighting setter spray was actually 50% off so it was on sale so if you have an near you run out and get you this but by the time this video comes out I don't think I'm doing you any good because the sale is gonna be off I got you next time. And that was it. That was everything that I purchased. And then because I spent like a good chunk of money, like $70, you know, I went a little crazy. I didn't mean to do that. My bank account was like, no, what are you doing? Because I spent that, I did get two free items. And one of them was the Better Than Sex, um, the little miniature mascaras. Then the last thing that I got for free because I purchased this was the Stella Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Liner. 
so it came like this and I think it's cool I've never had anything from Stella so this would be interesting but it's like one of the ones that I've showed you guys before in previous videos it's like a felt tip and I don't like eyeliners like this but it is Stella would that mean I don't know I want to say this eyeliner probably runs you like 20 25 dollars and like the regular size so I'm gonna give this a try because I'm never spending that much on an eyeliner so maybe <laughs> maybe this is gonna be great who knows but I, maybe I'll give it a try in my video today I don't know Ooh, Alright guys, so this is it. This is the end of the video. I know you guys are sad, but it's okay. I'll be back. That's everything that I purchased, and I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and if you like this video, don't forget to like the video and give it a thumbs up. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!